Most everyone I knew put the whole gray family down. They were the poorest family in our little Kansas town. Howard always looked too big in his silly ragged clothes. Kids all laughed at him and Gordy Jones would thumb his nose. Howard sat across from me in seventh grade at school. I didn't like it much, but Mama taught the golden rule. So when the spitballs flew at him, I never did join in. I guess that was the reason Howard thought I was his friend. And after things would quiet down, sometimes I'd turn and see the grateful eyes of Howard Gray looking back at me. Howard Gray, Howard Gray, somehow they got their kicks out of treating you that way. Deep down I sort of liked you, but I was too afraid of what they think about me, Howard Gray. One day after lunch, I went to comb my hair and saw they had Howard pinned against the lockers in the hall. They were poking fun about the big hole in his shirt and they had his left arm twisted back behind him till it hurt. Now to this day I can't explain and I won't try to guess Just how it was I wound up laughing right there with the rest I laughed until I cried and through my tears I still can see The tear-stained eyes of Howard Gray looking back at me Howard Gray, Howard Gray I can't believe I joined them all in treating you that way I wanted to apologize, but I was too afraid to be a friend to you, Howard Gray. From that moment on, after I made fun of him, he never looked my way, he never smiled at me again. After some time, I saw him then. I wonder if he remembers Howard Gray. We'll probably never meet again, so I can only pray that you and God forgive us, Howard Gray.